Now our next guest has recorded more than 50 albums, sold more than 15 million records and still topping the charts. And he's, do you know what, still surprising us all of the time. <laughs> it's a pleasure to have him in studio. It is Daniel O'Donnell. Good Great morning to, to you. Wow. How are you? We've been talking to you for so long on Skype. Like the last time we were talking to you was you and Magella in the bed. <laughs> You Who didn't bring, bring her? Oh, Lord, she's probably still in the bed. <laughs> <laughs> no, stop it, you could be getting in trouble here. Well, now, we do get to see in the bed again in your brand new video. I know. Which is Mass. a mini, it's like a mini horror film, The Night of the Daniels. Tell us about this. Well, you know, this is, this is the reason we did the Laddie Da video. The guys and React approached me before COVID ever had to see would I do a video with them because they're so creative. I wasn't aware of what they did then. Yeah. And I said, OK, we'll, we'll do something with you. And then COVID hit and there was no filming of anything. And they wanted to do it last year, this video that's out now. And still it was gathering people, as you saw in, in the video, and I wasn't comfortable. I found the Laddie Da song and I said to Kieran, my manager, why don't we get Kieran and Sean to do something for the laddie da and they took hold of it and <laughs> i mean i didn't know what i was doing as, uh, you know when i was doing it i mean i didn't know what i was doing this time well i had an idea this time <laughs> what it, you know what they were capable of but i mean this one is because last one was all green screen and like you're on surfboards and everything i know well this is the real deal oh listen it is the real deal and for people who haven't seen it i think shall we take it up? absolutely let's do enjoy it enjoy this Coming closer, the flames are now licking my body. Oh, won't you help me? Feel like I'm slipping away. It's hard to breathe, and my chest is a heaving. Lord of mercy, I'm burning a hole where I lay. Cause your kisses lift me higher. <laughs> and the Oscar goes to Daniel O'Donnell, come on. The, the things that happen when you had 60. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what? You're a great sport, though, aren't you? For a couple of guys who, who I'm sure people pitch stuff to you all yeah. the time, and you actually taking a gamble to do something like that. Well, you know, the joy of this is that all these people involved are living on my doorstep. Oh, right. You know, and the, the, we're, we're all within a, a few miles radius of yeah. one another. And to think that people with that creativity are living up at home. And I just, I think they're fantastic, each and every one of them that was involved in that. And all of the people that came out, mm -hmm. you know, the people that, the lo it's all local, nearly all local people, but now there were people who came from far away to, to be, you know, in the, in video, the video and just be there. We were there some nights till five in the morning wow. in the town and down low. You know. Because we have to, like, the basic premise, you're going to want, like, this is eight minutes. The basic premise is Daniel O'Donnell saves Dunlow from <laughs> Daniel O'Donnell's. <laughs> like, it's just so, like, thriller, bye-bye. We'll see you later I know, on. I know, I know. Do you like Halloween? Like, whenever this was pitched? Because you've got the grandkids now and stuff. Do I the know, I was kind of worried. I was, I'm thinking, I wonder, will they, you know, will they be frightened about it? But uh, I haven't really discussed it with them yet, what, the, what they're thinking. How do they feel know. about Granny and Grandad in the bed together, saving, oh, getting sure the phone call? Oh, <laughs> well, you The past no heed of anything. Did, did it take a lot to convince Magella to get into the video? Oh, no, she's game for anything. <laughs> oh, Lord, <laughs> no. She'd be getting a supporting actress. <laughs> <laughs> um, See them walking in the red You've joined TikTok as well, so is Magella a big part of that? Is she behind well, directing it for no, you? No, no, she wasn't there. Now, TikTok, to tell you the truth, I'm not sure what TikTok is at all. <laughs> I'm on it. But, um, and this is me, this was the first, I bought, wore this jumper for the TikTok. Okay, yeah, right. Yeah, so this is my TikTok jumper. Oh, this is the, this is the first, the <laughs> first thing out there. Aye. And, and you know, the funny thing about it was I went out, to the, I was in England doing some promotion for the album and I went out to the post office and I didn't pass any heed, you see, so I was sitting, did the TikTok thing and all and 
Then I kind of looked around like this and I seen this thing down my sleeve. A person, a board must have deposited on me when I was at the post office. And I said to the fellas, I said, I hope that's not a way to TikTok. Oh, sure as God, when TikTok came out. Viral. There you go. Down. Bird. Do Bird. people pick up on it? Oh, some. A fella did say it was a very authentic country look. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You've washed the top first oh, today. Oh, absolutely, yeah. Fair play to yeah. you. Because, uh, honestly, you joined TikTok and, like, the comments underneath your first video, finally, TikTok has become Maybe. a thing. Daniel is finally here. But it's not the first time that you oh, have I indeed know. gone viral on TikTok. Can we take a look? At, can we take a look at this video? Oh, God bless this. Hey, somebody's after saying Daniel Donald's coming in the night. Good joke. Can I say? You can't even see him, will you? I will, surely. Yeah. I wouldn't mind a picture of him. Same as that. Same as that. Same as that. Yeah. Same as that. Right. Let me know. All right. That was <laughs> done, you know, when we were filming the, the video, the night of the day. Oh, what was it? <laughs> He's great. That That's guy. the Donegal daddy. Yeah, 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 he's great. Was he giving you he tips? Did, he does loads of stuff on, on, on what is it, TikTok? TikTok? He's on all the time. <laughs> but he said to me, he says, he says, I, 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 well, will we do this? And I said, I, I didn't know what we were doing, you know. <laughs> I just said, I. Daniel, at this it? stage, could anyone ask you anything? And you'd be like, Daniel, will you be my godfather? <laughs> will you be the godfather to my child? <laughs> I, yeah, I will. I wouldn't yeah, have grand. to halt it there. I <laughs> was have... asked loads of times, you know, and I thought, no, you need somebody that's. About. That you might actually yeah. know. Yeah. You're teeing yourself up for this. I tell you, you're teeing yourself up for trouble as well. What about um, skincare, beauty, uh, you know, anti aging, whatever else is massive on TikTok as well? I mean, oh, look God. at you, you look fantastic. Oh, you're I wouldn't be at that carry on now. Oh, you're going to have huh? to give the secrets to the huh? aging perfectly. Jared Leto. Brad Pitt, they've all started their own lines, their own skincare, telling everyone how they're going to be... You look no, better than all of them. They ain't got nothing on Daniel. God. So, what's, your, what's your beauty tip? I'll have to be getting the, the seaweed, the, you know, the rack down on the, on the shore. On the shore. The my own. Is that what you <laughs> do? Do you just shove a bit enough. of... Actually, you just I don't shove Go anything. down and stick your head in the you seaweed. You do. I've seen a beauty tip from Daniel O'Donnell. Or the aqueous or the Silcox base. Silcox base, that's, that's, that's cream. Do you it because of that? That's I do. very good, isn't it? It's very good. Yeah. Cheap as chips. It lasts you know you for years. you know what I started do, doing too? Just for me, I get a lot of... Um, I had COVID in, in, in February. Yeah. And since it, my chest has kind of caught up. And I started steaming, you know, every... I do it maybe three or four times a day oh, to right. clear. Do you have the towel over the head? No, I have a thing, a beauty. It's a beauty thing, you see, and you can put your face in. You it. bought the thing with the plastic thing that you and put your face it's in. it's easier to steam. I'm so not even I, joking. Right now, people, they're just going and buying them. That's it. Daniel on. O'Donnell says, and you can look like so this. So as well as the chest been clear. The... Look at the pores. <laughs> perfect, doesn't he? <laughs> I'll be gorgeous. The pores are fantastic. For 40 years in showbiz, you will be in February. Like, it's some achievement. I mean, I'd say 40 years, 39 years ago, you never would have dreamt no. to be still topping the charts well, and have videos like this. I out. made the first record in February 1983, went up to Big Tom Studios. Yeah, brilliant. And um, I could never, ever have imagined that all these years later, you know, that this album... And, you know, this new album has all, bar four songs, it's all Irish writers. Um, I, I sent out a message to them, you know, I'd recorded stuff before mm. from all of them. And I said, I'm going to record, have you anything written or would you like to write something? And they came back with all these great songs. So much so that I have next year's album nearly done. Ready to go? Yeah. Wow. But you have been a supporter of artists, artists, you know, your contemporaries, writers, and people who have, who have followed you, who have come up behind you for years. Like, it's been very important to you to bring people along with you. Yeah, well, you know, it's not easy to start. Yeah. And I suppose if I see somebody, if I've seen somebody on here now, especially some of the young ones, if I had any contact for them, I would let them know that they did well. When I started, you know, very few people give me encouragement. And that wasn't that they didn't want me involved. They just thought at that time, you know, discos was coming in and they thought the music business was finished as we knew it. Yeah. But it's never finished. There's always going to be um, an Irish flavour here. Oh, yeah. People will always want a certain amount of people. I mean, the country music and the Irish ballads, that's what we are, mm. you know. 
And, and, and you were a brilliant supporter for that, even right through COVID, when a lot of artists were really struggling out there. You were such a great spearhead and trying to push their causes forward as well. Yeah. And, and, well, because well, even we're talking with that with Irish music, like Irish music, it's in such a really strong position. There are so many young people coming through and we're seeing the concerts are back now. People yeah. are really enjoying getting out and enjoying it. And, and even for you, like you have this tour coming up as well in, in this summer. Yeah. I mean, things like this must be so, so exciting to be back out no, there it and is. loving it. And it's great because like we, we just did Killarney um, at the end of August. And this is the first tour in Ireland we have done since probably, I would say 2018 now. COVID has kind of put us, mm. you don't know why, when you were out last. I think 19 we did Killarney <clears throat> and then it's hard to mind when we were, God. you know, we're supposed to do shows and they were postponed, postponed. So, like, we'll be all round oh, Ireland fierce, excited. In, in August. So, look, and the tickets go on sale. Well, the board gosh is on sale, yeah. but the others go on sale uh, the 18th, 19th. Yeah, the board gosh, it's the 27th of August, yeah. obviously, 2023. I mean, the place is going to be going mad for it, particularly with these music videos and everything else. I just see you at Electric Picnic next year. <laughs> I'm not joking. I see Daniel O'Donnell. I was there in a caravan this year. You were in did a you caravan? The, no, but did you see that? There was once had a caravan. Oh, yeah. Some kind of Daniel and <laughs> In a Daniel, Daniel and Magella yeah. caravan at it. Mm -hmm. Would you perform, Daniel if they asked you, there. would you perform at Electric Picnic next year? You know, year? Kieran and the band, the musical director, Kieran Mitchell, he says, we We'll do the picnic, we'll do the picnic. I said, what picnic? He said, electric picnic. <laughs> I said, what would I be doing there? <laughs> but sure, do you know what? Let's put it out there now. Who knows? Let's put it out there now. You would tackle now. anything. I think you would tackle be absolutely anything amazing. The brand new album, I Wish You Well, is out on Friday, the 4th of November, with just some lovely songs in it. And the video is an utter joy. Daniel O'Donnell, thanks for joining us. Thanks a million. Daniel's it's great, great to see you.